blessed sunday blessed sunday my people we thank god for life hallelujah blessed sunday to you all my family my friends in christ jesus how are you all doing may the mercies of god be upon us be upon our life be upon our children be upon our wives be upon our husbands be upon everything we lay our hands to do in the mighty name of jesus i just bring you the word of god for today that says it pays to be righteous it pays to be righteous so i would like to like you to know that being a righteous person is indeed a big gain in the in the modern days of our life when you are a righteous person so I want to let you know that righteousness is the quality of being morally right and justifiable and it also say you have to be truthful having a good behavior and doing things right so when i say it pays to be righteous you if you are in the spirit you will understand what i mean by that because it pays to be righteous when you are righteous every other thing that you ask of the lord he will do it for you diligently so i want to read the bible verse which says in proverbs chapter 4 verse 18 it says but the path of the just is as the shining light that shineth more and more unto the perfect day so you see what i'm trying to say when you do things right when you do things in the right manner you see god will supply every of your needs in a special way that's why he said the just is the is as the shining light the just is as the shining light that shineth more and more unto the perfect day so and it's also said in proverbs 11 4 he said riches profit not in the day of wrath but righteousness delivereth from death you understand what i read now so that is why it is good to always do things right let god lead you in the right path where you will not make mistake in life so i bring you good tidings this day that god is not asleep god is not a god that will forsake his own he always want us to open our hearts unto him lay our petitions unto him then he will be there to answer us speedily in times of when we go on our knees to pray pray for whatever we need and it also said in proverbs 19:23 he said the fear of the lord tender to life and he that hath it shall abide satisfied. He shall not be visited with evil. You see, you shall be satisfied. You shall have plenty. And no evil shall befall you. And he will continue to deliver you from evil. And no evil plans of the enemy will visit your home or visit any member of your family. So try your possible best to engage yourself in doing right because the righteousness of God is as a rock on which we stand. 
when we sing unto his glory, when we worship him, when we praise him, when we call upon his name, the king of kings, the ancient of days, the Alagbada you know, that I am, that I am, the king of glory, the marvelous God. He will not let us down. He will always be there for us. When you call upon his name, that he is the mighty God, the great God, the God that sees everything in secret, it will open your heart, your eyes, it will open your heart, and you will see beyond more than what you are seeing now in the mighty name of Jesus. So I bring you the love of Christ because I love to share the word of God with people that don't have enough experience. I like sharing because it is good to always share with others so that people that don't know the word very well will always go deeper and deeper to search the word of god and try to build themselves up in the right way and in the right manner so thank you for listening to me thank you for encouraging me i can see how blessed i am by you supporting me by you helping me to push forward i say thank you to you all without you i cannot make it i cannot be here talking to you or preaching the word but i say thank you to all of you that have given me the power to push through may god continue to bless you and your family bless anything that you lay your hands to do God will continue to support you in one way or the other. He will never leave you. He will never forsake you. You shall rise like the star that you want to be. You shall proclaim the word of God and you shall be the head and not the tail. God bless you and God bless all your endeavors in life in the mighty name of Jesus. I praise the name of the Lord today for another Sunday like this, that God has given me the opportunity to come out to speak his word. It's not by my power, not by my, my strength, but it is by the will of God I am here today to thank him for all he has been doing. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. We want to thank you for everything you've done for us and our families in the mighty name of Jesus. So do have a wonderful Sunday today and make sure you praise and worship God and pray for the week to come so that your week shall be successful in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen and amen. So bye now and take care of yourselves. Bye. Hallelujah. We praise the name. We praise the name. Father, I give you all the glory. Father, I give you all the praise. Father, I give you all the honor. Father, I give you all my praise. Thank you, Jesus. Bye.